What's good YouTube, your boy Bosco back again with another video. Hopefully you're having a great day wherever you are in the universe. Here at the mall right now, about to go ahead and see what's in there. It just opened a few minutes ago. Uh, we had the Fox Hills or Culver City Westfield Mall, however you would like to call it. And uh, they got a few stores in here, so let's go see what's going on. If you like what you see, if you like what you see, smash the like button, share the video, and definitely don't forget to subscribe, you dig? So they got these mids right here, which are pretty dope. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Pretty crazy. Let me know what you guys think. They got these also here too from Baby Max Pluses in this colorway. I think these are pretty fire. I never really seen this colorway. Top pass, fire or trash. Black and silver, rated colorways all day. Griffies, the blue Griffies are still here chilling out, posted up. I haven't worn mine yet. I guess I will break them out very soon because they are fire. And they got the PlayStations on deck. The PG5 PlayStations on deck. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? With this being such a generic release, I guess that's why they don't light up this time. I think that's unfortunate. But what do you guys think about these in the comment section below, man? The colorway is pretty fire, though. I'm not going to lie. But I like the second colorway better. The one that has more of a black base. You know what I'm saying? So they got these on deck, too. These KD-13s or KD-14s are pretty dope. We've seen them at other places. Um, but this is the latest colorway. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. The latest addition to the KD Trey 5 series. This colorway is pretty dope, too. Kind of got that gum out. So I'm not mad at these, bro. You know what I'm saying? I think they're gonna come out with some good colorways of these. $90, so it's under $100. This is the KD budget model. They also got these on deck too, and a men's sizes here. They might have them in grade school sizes, but they do have them in adult sizes for sure. And they also got these on deck in men's sizes as well. And there definitely have been some people out there looking for these also. Now we got them on sale for $85. Uh, I haven't seen them maybe a little cheaper, but uh, $85 is not bad. So they got some different Air Force Ones right here. Kind of like a different type of material on the upper. Very light. Let me know what you guys think about these. And then they also got this colorway for the Air Force Ones with the rose or peach on the tongue. Not bad. What do we think about these Air Force Ones with the... Okay, these are not too bad. Now we picked up this model in a different colorway for Squad before. Let me know what you guys think about the black with the uh, patent leather features. Kind of like a Concord vibe. <laughs> Cop pass, fire or trash on these. Never seen these Air Force ones before. These must be for kids, or are these editions of these? I'm about to say, are these like Space Jam edition Air Force ones? I've never seen them before. Hopefully, you guys can hear me. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Ninety dollars. And I've never seen, I've never seen this colorway of the uh, Westbrook. This is a gray school colorway. Not bad. Also got the little shine to it. Here's it with the, with the light on it. Crazy. I like the little iridescent situation. Which Westbrook is this? Now, what is going on here for the grade school? These are grade school, but they're 105. Crazy, crazy, crazy. What do we think about these? These are ridiculous, bro. What the hell? I'm a fan. These are mids. People will go crazy for these, bro. One to 10 scale, what do you guys think? Let's see if somebody from the squad wants some. Oh, it looks like she's gonna pick up a pair. Everything's just looking crazy right there, right? Fire shoe. These are fire, bro. Now, these right here are pretty dope. I've been seeing these colorways more. Not mad at this one. $90 on the retail. The Waffle One. Got those Air Maxes again we talked about. Now we got them more of in a white and black base colorway. Uh, 150 on the retail for these. They feel comfortable. They are lower to the ground. Looks kind of dope. And then this Air Max is kind of cool. I mean, I like the color combination on it. You know what I mean? Retail is $90, so that's not bad for a $90 shoe. Air Max 90s for the ladies once again. Another colorway that I haven't yet. I've had, you know, I haven't seen this colorway yet. Definitely perfect for this time of year. Let me know what we're thinking about these. We definitely send this to the Hurt Energy Group, you dig? Which is a, a section for the females, for the ladies who support, the women who support. Uh, we got a section just for them too, called Hurt Energy, that's a group chat. Also with on, within IG. But squad in general, what do we think about these Air Max 97s? I like this color combination. 97 is one of my favorite Air Maxes. If you did not know, now you know. 2090s. These 2090s right here are kind of different. You know what I'm saying? 135 on a retail. 
Air Max 90s, multiple colors going on here for the women. I mean, they gonna, they look like they're going to be doing their thing this summertime. Air Max 90s about to come hard this time. I, I feel it. With everything I'm seeing so far, let me know what you guys think about these two Air Max 90s. These right here are crazy, bro. This right here is something different, bro. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. I like this blue. 100 on the retail. That's a fire blue right there. A very dope blue on these. And then a um, new a Nike Challenger OG, $90 on these. I like the... I like the color combination, the tan with that orange is definitely fuego. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Now, these Adidas, uh, they got women, you know, something that would be in the women's section, but they are on the men's side, but I'm sure they have both sizes, I don't know. Uh, the Climacools, man, 180. Climacool DNA, color combination is not bad. Definitely feels like it's a women's shoe. Maybe it's just a summer shoe, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think about this colorway. It is pretty dope. You know what I mean? And the shoe looks nice. Uh, then we've seen them in that colorway before too, but I guess this is the latest addition to it. Got more Adidas behind here with some sale tags. I do like this 2021 right here, of course. It's down to 130 as opposed to uh, 100 or 180 was normal. You know what I'm saying? They got size 8 through 13 on these still. So if anybody out there does want these, you can get them out on sale. And then we got the uh, a black colorway. They got more and more colorways of these boosts, man. Not bad on these cop pass fire trash from a one to ten scale. What would you guys rate these in the comment section below? Now we see some Air Max 90s. I'm telling you, they come with Air Max 90s in crazy colorways for the women and for the men this summer. This is like got the cork situation going on. I think one of the other models I saw had this going on and I didn't make that out correctly. Now I can see it with better lighting. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? I think they are pretty fire, man. 130 on the retail for these. Feel like it might be a collab with that there. Maybe that's just some type of theme. I don't know. But these are pretty dope. This must be the cork series. Must be. Got the navy blue on there. It's kind of crazy right there, right? I'm a fan of these. It's not hard to mess up an Air Max 90, man. Navy blue. That cork situation. Also is nice too. Wonder how many people like these. Got the green leaf on the tongue as well with the Nike swoosh. Like I said, 130 on the retail also. These are pretty nice. White and black, can't mess it up, can match with anything. Retail is 120, cop pass, fire or trash on these. Can't go wrong with Harachis. Some more Air Max 90s for men. Uh, white, black with the Vogue green. Pretty nice, man. What do you guys think about this color combination as well? One in 10 scale. Air Max 95s, got the cork situation also. What do we think about these? Color combinations on these is fire, bro. Definitely, definitely dope. One in 10 scale, what do we think about this series? Yeah, I'm not mad at these at all. So, another colorway. They're gonna keep trying. Nothing that really struck me yet, but I do like this model. Just haven't found a colorway that I'm a fan of just yet. What do you guys think about oh these? God. Latest colorway of the Air Ma of Vapor Max Evo. Uh, what do you guys think about this colorway? Some people like them, some people don't. If you haven't given me your opinion, let me know in the comment section below. Important. Maybe at some point, you know what I'm saying? Right color combination and uh, right price. These retail for 200 Definitely fire shoe, though. Air Max 95s. Got some Nike print all on the toe box area. Not bad on these. What do you rate these? And uh, is this something you pick up? Definitely good for the summertime. And you know I like some triple black or majority black. I don't know how I feel about these. But they are not bad. Orange going on, you know what I mean? Does have some 3M on the back. Can't really go wrong with Air Max 95s, of course. Give me your thoughts and opinions on these. So the Cork series continues with the Daybreak type. Not bad. Color combination is cool. You know what I'm saying? What do you guys think about these in the 1 in 10 scale? Not really feeling it on this model for some reason, to me personally, but it's still pretty cool. And the retail is only $100, so you can't go wrong with that. Then you got this colorway. Very light shoe. Are you guys rocking with these or not? Then we got a pair even back here on sale for $60 as opposed to $90. We definitely saw this before. The purple and then the gold. Laker colors, if you will. What do we think about these superstars? What do we think about these Adidas? 
color combination is different. That's why I picked them up to see what you guys thought about them. 110 on the retail. Air Force One's on deck too. Very light shoe. Air Force One Crater fly net. What, what do you guys think about this colorway? Or the shoe in itself is very light. For the ladies, they got these. I like this color combination. This one is actually pretty fire. One in 10 scale. What do we think about these waffle ones? They've been coming with some good colorways for these shoes, man. Especially for the time of year that we are in. Let me know what you guys are thinking. Sending these pictures out, of course. We do got some Hirachis. And that fire red colorway. And that triple black colorway. So those orange ones have sold out since we were here. Now they got these shadow lows, which are crazy. $75 for these. These are fire. I think people would want these. Yeah, I'm a fan of this colorway right here. Gray school pair. They just put these out. These white and black shadows are ridiculous. Seven, $75 on them. I don't see anybody else, you know, with them. I mean, they just put these things out, so nobody knows that they're here right now. I'm not pulling the trigger on them, but they do look pretty dope. And hopefully somebody in the squad wants them. So these right here, these, this hat is pretty far too. I haven't seen. Oh, I did see somebody with this hat actually. I did see somebody with this hat actually. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. This is going for $34. That's actually pretty far. Wait, was it fitted though? It's fitted though. And then they got the Houston Astro ones also, which is pretty dope. Thank you very much, man. This is pretty dope too. Fitted hats only. Then we got a New York one. That's oh, they're killing it with these these hats. I just don't like the fitted hat, bro. I like the snapback, and it's funny because I used to only be a a fitted hat dude, and now it's just all about the snapbacks for me. It's more easy to adjust when I change up how long my hair is and how long it's not. You feel me? But these are definitely fire. Life sucks. I think we've seen this one before. Bigger size, of course. This thing is heavy. <laughs> what do you guys think about this one in the comment section below? We just picked these up for squad member two uh, just yesterday. Colorway is fire, man. What do you guys think about these Air Forces, man? I think these are dope. So we just left JD. Uh, pretty good there, to say the least. We found some PlayStation 5s. The PlayStation PG5 for the homie Daniel squad up. Luckily for us, he's coming out here in a couple days, so he'll be able to get the pair for me individually. So shout out to him for that. And uh, now we're gonna go over here and head over to Foot Locker and see what's there. I'm pretty sure they got something in the store. And then we got a few more places to check out. We got Foot Action, Kids Foot Locker for the people who like the Kids Foot Locker. Sheik is here, Champs. So, you know, we all go through everything. We got some time to go through all the stores and take our time there. So hopefully we're leaving out here with a lot of stuff for the squad, you feel me? Mall is definitely the mall is definitely back alive and well. It's crazy. It's cool, but it's also kind of nerve-wracking at the same time. Yeah, look at that. So now we over here, here at the mall. We got like a few more stores to go to, and hopefully we come across something worthwhile. Because uh, I mean, that first location, JD was actually pretty good, bro. JD has some good stuff, so hopefully the other stores can follow suit, you know what I mean? That would be ideal. Hopefully that music's not too loud. I'm sure you guys can probably still hear me. Maybe, maybe not. I'll know when I replay it in the editor. Can't record here. I usually can't record here, so we're gonna have to play it low key in here, you dig? Griffey's looking pretty right there in that light, you dig? More of the bulls, up tempos. I like the color combination of this new balance right here. 185 on the retail though, I'm good on that. But these are clean. I don't care, but I'm gonna show this because somebody might care. If this is a different shoot or flex and switch up what they was doing, this might be something to cop. $14.99, so $15. Shoes normally $65, so there's wiggle room to be made. But we passing on these. Get some of your pizza at. You got that real flame. See that flame in there? That real flame in there, boy. Yeah, you stick your hand in that. So I just came to grab me some pizza really quick. Uh, this place is looking good. I've had it before the other day, maybe like a week ago. 
and it was a good, you know, first impression. So we back again. There's the name of it right there. Man, DC. Fire foods, fire pizza, fire organic. Made it right in front of you, you know what I mean? So I'm about to go ahead and wait for my grub and then we're gonna go ahead and uh, check out some more shoes. I'll see you guys in a second. So we're here at the Sheik inside the uh, mall, about to check out and see what's going on here. Uh, this is the Jordan section that they're in. This location does have some pretty good stuff from shoes and apparel. Let me know what you guys think about what you see in here. Of course, leave me the feedback in the comment section below. And like I said, this is Sheik inside the Kobe City Mall. Let's go ahead and tap in. Got some good stuff, you know what I mean? They always got some pretty good merch here. They got some NBA shorts, $80 for the Hornets one, the white colorway. Is this still a mellow ball? Oh no, it's Washington. I'm just confused on who Washington is, but they got him from, uh, they got his jersey there, which is dope. They got the 80 and LeBron ones, the $110 ones. They got these Chicago ones, white, pretty dope jersey. So they got some Hardens over here too. We talked about these before when I was here. Um, they got that McDonald's All-American one, man. This one right here is actually pretty dope. Um, nobody for some reason, you know, they're dope, but they're not for me. And I, you know, I don't blame it. Nobody I know really wants them. I do think the colorway is pretty dope though. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Then they got these. These are pretty dope. Uh, this color combination, not too bad. Uh, 180 on the retail, cop or pass the knees. Tell me what you guys think about these Paul Georges, bro. One to 10 scale, honest opinions. I definitely like these so far better than, than the black, black and white ones that I have. These are clean, one to 10 scale, cop or pass. Very, very dope colorway. Very dope colorway. That toe box is popping. I like this shit. So they got some, some Dodger shirts and hoodies, which are pretty dope too. They usually have a lot of good merch here, so it just depends on what you're looking for, bro. These are pretty fire, y'all. That Laker tee is pretty dope too. Hold up, y'all, I'm getting a And then they got these Bulls jerseys and the Laker jersey. Now this one is pretty fire. This Pippin one right here. Does give me a bathe and ape vibe. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Let me see what's going on here. 150. 150. That's not bad. And they got the shorts too. These are crazy. I like the shorts. Lakers Shaq jersey right here. This one's pretty dope too. I think the retail's still 150 on them. Stitching is pretty fire, bro. And they got the shorts to match. I'm a shorts guy. I probably will go with the shorts more than I do the actual uh, the actual jersey. These are pretty dope, man. Got the quality that I want for my shorts. Price on the shorts is $100, though. Fundo. Dope shorts. Apparently, apparently, she has these. So we seen the LeBron tee last time I was out. We saw those at Foot Locker, Hollywood and Highland. But apparently now there's a Kyrie one also. Oh, they got, oh man, we might have to pull a trigger y'all before I leave. What would y'all go with the white one or the red one? The red one is ridiculous, bro. I think I might, 35. Yeah, before we leave, we probably leave with that Kyrie. There's a black one. I didn't even know that. Damn. They always got the merch here, man. They always got some dope merch here, bro. Paul George jersey as he's holding it down right now. $110 retail. They got the white LeBron jersey for $110 also on the retail. Go to the wide angle for this. They got the LeBron 23 jersey. They got the Chicago jersey. The white jersey. Okay. I see some shorts. These are some uh, custom Laker shorts, or, or are these like a new? I don't know if these are coming out or not. $55. Not really a fan of them. Yeah, not really a fan of those. Uh, got some red ones, I guess, for Chicago. But this right here, this right here, though, is what, what, it's, what it is. This is what it is right here. 
Will we find it at the outlet cheaper? I don't know. Retail is 80 bucks. That's not a bad price for these. Actually, I might not get them from here. It all depends on how the rest of my trip goes. I might not get the shirt from here. I might get it from uh, like a Foot Locker or a Flex site. But uh, this is pretty dope though. What do you guys think about the Kyrie shirt? We haven't, we haven't seen the witness in this colorway. I've never seen these witnesses before. Gray school size, $89 on these. Copper pass. What do you guys think about these? We definitely picked these up for squad in the past. They got some more pair of them here. 90 bucks on the retail. They got those eights for the ladies too. And I see they got some sizes of these. I don't know if maybe just grade school. I didn't see no adult sizes, but these are pretty fire, man. What do you guys think about these 13s? So in the grade school section here at Champs, City of Moreno Valley, I guess that's where he's from. They got a new pair of Kawhis. Colorway is not bad at all. And they got some good quality on here. Retail is 140 for the Kawhis. What do you guys think about those? Gray school, they also got these mids. And they got these lows too, these tropical twists. I haven't seen this at any other location <laughs> besides this chance here at uh, Fox Hill. So shout out to them for that. And then they got the latest one with the rings on the back. Rings and things, trophies, rings. Kyrie Sevens. You know, some of the hats they have here. Let me know if you guys see something that stands out to you, of course. Screenshot it, let me know. There are a lot of hats up there, though. More hats up here. Compton, LA, Crenshaw, LA, East LA. They got all kinds of different hats up here, you know what I'm saying? Depending on what you're looking for. This World Series. Angels and A's, got the World Series on the side. You got the New York, Los Angeles hat. These are all fitted hats, I guess, right? This one right here is pretty dope. Pretty, pretty far, actually. Let me know what y'all think about this one. I think it's pretty dope. 45 on the retail. They got the one with the flag on it. Uh, this LA one is pretty dope too with the World Series patch. Last time I saw these Iversons, they were in gray school pair. But these ones right here are pretty dope. Let me know what you guys think about these. Newer pair. Um, Some place had them out early. So now we finally got them in the regular way. What do you guys think about these Iversons? Yo, Daniel, is this the hat you were just talking about? Let me know. Right into Liz, you guys got some, they got some heat right here. I think Squaw want that. That blue hat. Got the camel bill. Got the blue bill. Oh, that's fine right there. Never really came in this jersey place because it's a trap for me. It is definitely a trap for me, as you guys can see what's here. You guys see why I say that. So much heat. They got the shorts and all the sizes you want. They got all the heat here, bro. This is why I don't come into the spot. <laughs> it's gonna make me spend something, you know what I mean? Iverson jerseys, Roy Allen jerseys. Look at this Houston Rockets jersey, which is pretty fire, too. So you guys can see really what it is, bro. It's just a lot. I like this uh, George jersey's cool, too. Nuggets one's kind of crazy. These are crazy. Wow. Yeah, so far, so good. Thank you, bro. Damn, these is crazy. I remember that Larry Johnson jersey before. Man. Man. So we got the little figurines. I can imagine these might be worth something sooner or later, right? Different all-star, different players. But this thing right here in the mall, they got all the jerseys from like all the sports that you would want to. I'm sure you guys have seen things like this before. Um, so if you guys are ever into jerseys, I mean, I got a place, a few places, not just this mall, but a lot of malls got certain jerseys that you might not find other places. But you know, it's just up to you. We got college jerseys. They got that iris and jersey over there. That's fire too. I think we found them, Daniel, all the way at the top. Two on the left. Fresno State Paul George jersey. $100. Yeah. Pretty dope. Okay. Oh, that's Leonard. Kawhi Leonard's jersey. Kawhi Leonard's college jersey. San Diego State. Okay, they got throwbacks in here. So we still here at the mall. 
just left Champs, just left that lid store or that hat store, jersey store, pretty dope. We got one more store to check out, maybe two, because we got foot action and then there's Kids Foot Locker. Yeah, man, like I said, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the video. We're about to go talk about some more shoes. Real quick, let me show you guys something we picked up for the squad and let me know what you guys think about that and then we'll get into foot action. All right, let's go ahead and take a closer look at these bad boys, which we did pick up for squad, man. These are fire. Size 13, however, you know, I'm not going to get them yet. I mean, I think I might at some point soon. Um, Griffey's are one of my favorite shoes. I mean, this colorway is something different, bro. I need to know your honest thoughts and opinions on these from a 1 to 10 scale. We did pick up. This is the second shoe out the Griffey pack. We picked up the Air Max 90 for squad. Now we got these Griffey's for squad. These are dope, man. I have to give them a 10 out of 10. And the parts that I didn't like about it before is not even, it's irrelevant now. It was about this up here, feeling like it was too much white. But seeing these more and more, the more I pull these things out the box and check them out, having them in hand, these things are dope. 10 out of 10 in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. So here at Foot Action as we're back, hopefully you guys did like that shoe. We got some Iversons here in two different colorways. Then we got, um, we got some people who do like these, man. Puma RXs, these, this colorway is not bad. What do you guys think about this one in the comment section below? Retail is uh, 110. Now this right here is some retail arbitrage for me. The ranking on these are really great. 170 is the normal retail. 69.99 is the retail for them here. You know, discounts and stuff like that. Can easily get these off for like 120 or more. Uh, 170 is normally retail, so I, I'd go higher than that, you know what I mean? Pretty dope, $59, normally 110. Not too bad on these. Some Pumas with the flags on them, those look pretty dope. <laughs> it's like red or blue, what do you want though, you know what I mean? Not so much with this one, it's 69 for 140. I mean, there is some, some room to be made there too. Uh, but I don't know, I have to think about these. Yeah, they're pretty dope too. I like the color combination on them for the kids or grade school or maybe for the women over here. 130 on them though. What do you guys think about these? Came across some things for the squad, of course.